Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the 100 subscribers slash video special. Now before I start talking, I just wanted to say my initial plan for this video was I was going to do a montage of like all my 100 videos, just like picking out funny bits and stuff, but I realized that was going to take a while and with so far how this week's going, I wanted to keep a consistent schedule and for once I'm actually wanting to start getting my schedule built up. And now is my chance, uh, especially with all this quarantine stuff going on, I can have time to edit videos and upload them and stuff. And I have, I have a good amount of videos planned. Um, so, but basically in this video I just want to talk about a few things, I just want to give my thanks and share my thoughts on how it's like being a small YouTuber and just seeing what I've seen so far. But when I initially started YouTube, I didn't really have high hopes for becoming anything big. I'm not saying I'm not saying that I'm big right now. I just like still to this day I don't th I don't have high hopes like oh, I'm going to be famous. Oh, I'm going to get so popular. Everyone's going to see my stuff. No, I don't have that mindset at all. I'm I've ever since the beginning, I've been doing YouTube as something as just simply just to have fun with, you know, experimenting with like different video games and uploading them to like my YouTube channel just to share to the viewers that watch my stuff and you know, like being able to have the creativity it, the way my mindset is when it comes to making videos, it's like making your own home movie. Basically, you're making your own episodes to a s series of your life, just uploading it through a specific category, and for me, that's just gaming. I mean, I do other types of videos, like sometimes I do, like, montages, or I've done, like, some trailer stuff, and some other random videos, but I like to do a lot of different things, and with YouTube, I like to upload some of the stuff that's creative to me, and it's just really fascinating. And whatever viewers see my stuff, I'd like to share what I made with them. And speaking of that, it's, it fascinates, it fascinates, fit, why can I not say that word? It fascinates me, like, not only because my one of my videos, the Modern Warfare series tribute, just hit 11,000 views. And not only the number blows my mind, but I have the mindset just thinking, wow, I am such a small YouTube channel. And I have like no experience with like public crowds or being super social and stuff. I'm not a social guy. I'm an introvert. I do not like socializing at all i mean i'll talk to people but like this is getting off the point but seeing eleven thousand people that i do not know have seen my video and enjoyed it like the video has over like 400 likes like 450 right now i think but it's eleven thousand people that i have never met in my life who have watched something that I have seen, or, I mean, made, and they liked it. Well, I mean, there were some people that didn't like it, but... I mean, that, that's okay. I mean, I don't care. I don't care if you don't like my videos, that's fine. I'm just making videos that I like. But... Um... It, it's just such a fascinating mindset to have, like, thinking... 11,000 people. That's a faking huge number. Now, I'm not saying I'm a popular person. No, I'm still just a small YouTuber. Do I have plans for being big? Well, that's up for um, fate to decide, basically. That's up for how my channel goes. I'm just gonna keep uploading for the sake of just uploading because it's fun. YouTube is fun to me. I like making videos. I like recording them. I like playing what I love to do, like playing video games, I love doing that, and I love editing videos, because you can just pour in so much creativity. And, like, right now in high school, I'm taking a 
on TV and radio class, which is basically a news program that our school does. And there we have to do the like, different newscasts where we're camera operators, uh, the reporters, or we're working in the studio messing with like teleprompters and uh, the stuff that pops up on the screen. And me and my friend, it, you, you've you probably seen him in some of my videos, Mr. TNT Master. He's um, in that class with me and we'll like work on different edited projects, like different, um, like, different intros and stuff for the news and with our edit like with our couple years of editing experience like it, they're just so good and our teacher enjoys the hell of them <laughs> but editing is a fascinating thing to me and I don't know if it's anything I'm gonna push towards like as a career I mean if anything, if YouTube gets big for me, then maybe I'll push that as a career, but I don't know if like a career path I would do like video editing or anything, maybe, I don't know. But it'd be fun. If, if I did, it would be fun as all hell. But yeah, as like seeing the number hit a hundred, like I, I know like maybe 10 or 20 of the subscribers is like my friends, like I know that. Like, 20 of the subscribers are my friends, but, you know, that's, that's 80 other people that I don't know. <laughs> yeah, be being a small YouTuber is, is fascinating. Nowadays, it, it, nowadays, it's really hard to be a small YouTuber, be, like, especially in the gaming um, area of YouTube because there's so many gaming channels and there's so many popular ones it's just really hard for small youtubers like me to grow and like that's why you'll see a lot of like really small content creators like just out there just doing all this great content but they're not well noticed so they just kind of give up YouTube like oh I'm not gonna get anywhere um, but, um, but yeah, the YouTubers that are posting all right content and out there with a big fan base, you know, they're getting most of the attention because those are the, that's the YouTubers they know. So small YouTubers are like us, or it's really hard for us to grow and to share our content. But when it's shared, then it's, it's a fascinating like thing. Wish I, w I wish I could have done more for this 100th video special, but I wanted to just to share my thoughts and to just say thanks, and I appreciate all the support I've been, um, that you guys have given me these past two years. This These past two years have been, um, probably the best for me in my internet career. But, yeah, as far as the channel goes, I'm gonna just continue uploading as I usually do um, my plan is I'm gonna try uploading every day or every other day that's gonna be my goal um, if anything if I have to I can upload two times a week um, if things are bad but you know I'm gonna try and get an upload schedule fixed up and I'm gonna try and get more videos out um, but yeah really I didn't have much to talk about I just wanted to share like Again, I just wanted to share my thoughts and just to say thanks. But yeah, um, here's to future growth to a, cha to a small channel. And let's see if we can possibly get to a thousand subscribers. I would like that to be my next goal. It's going to be uh, it's going to be a longer um, milestone, but I'm willing to accept that challenge and let's see if we get somewhere but again thank you all so much it means the world to me and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out